What's going on? What's going on? We back, good fellow sports TV, and um, Floyd Mayweather reveal how much he be making versus tension. It's the exhibition fight that he be having on New Year's Eve in Tokyo. All right, he said he'd be making anywhere between four to ten million, million dollars, U.S. dollar, um, to fight uh, tension in a three round exhibition, um, three minute three round exhibition. So he he making four to ten million dollars wouldn't uh, specify a, and wouldn't give a hard number. So he said four to ten million dollars for exhibition. Um, said he'd be making more than both Fury and Wilder in this exhibition. Um, so you know he said he already got two million dollars for even doing a press conference. So um, so he said it'd be a, a strictly boxing rules. Um, no kicking. Said he ain't never getting the MMA ring. He all he a boxer. And um, he's retired. And he's just going to be doing exhibitions now. He said it won't affect him. Uh, if It won't affect his legacy if he loses or get knocked out. It's just an exhibition. He only going to be doing boxing exhibitions. And he retired. And he's going to be continuing to do a lot of exhibitions now. So uh, so basically he's a circus show. He's a circus show. All right. Or you can just say it's the equivalent of, of, of like when Muhammad Ali did European tours and stuff of that nature. And just... Going across the world and sparring and getting big money. So, you know, that is what it is. So, he getting money. Um, Leonard Ellaby stressed um, this past weekend in Wilder Fury. He stressed that, um, that um, you know, Mayweather wasn't stressing for money. He gets a seven-figure uh, ch uh, check every month. He said he don't need money then. I mean, I mean, why is he still fighting? You know what I'm saying? He was in his feelings after the Wilder Fury fight. Because apparently he bet on uh, Fury and he lost. And it's been said that he has a betting problem. But obviously my, my stance on it is that get every damn dollar, get every damn dime while you can. Because when you're not able to box and move and run and, and be slick no more, when your body stops being in motion, that's when you, you, you lose it. So it's good for him to stay in the heat of the battle, I guess, health-wise. And especially if there ain't going to be no real danger, they might as well put the headgear on too. You know what I'm saying? And um, they paying you four to ten million dollars plus two million dollar bonus for a press conference. Who gonna turn down that money versus a guy that's significantly smaller than you? All right, and fight at like paperweight or something like that. Whatever you fight at, as a kickboxer, he's a kickboxer, not even a boxer. So, um, yeah, he about to rob the bank once again. That's what Floyd do. Um, it won't be shown in the United States, so you have to stream it. So, um, so be it. You know, won't be no judges. Get your money. I ain't mad at anybody getting their money, man. I, I'm not. I don't, this don't bother me. It hurt my spirit, none. He ain't taking no TV time out. He ain't bumping Deontay Wilder out of a time slot or nothing like that. You know what I'm saying? But guess what? This week it was supposed to be announced. Devontae Tank Davis and Adam Morris probably was supposed to fight, and now it, it's, it's starting to come out hints that that fight won't happen, or it may be in jeopardy. I know Adam Morris said, you know, something about Mayweather and them scared. So, for Tank. But hopefully that, that fight will get now soon. It's supposed to be happening in February on its own individual Showtime card. Uh, from what I understand, Showtime will unveil their first half of fights in January uh, out of Steven Espinosa's mouth. It was an uh, interview I seen from a barbershop conversation. They won't do it this year, so next year. So uh, Fox did their thing, and now Showtime will do their thing. But Floyd insists that he's in retired. So that means one thing, and one thing only for me. If Earl Spence beat Mikey Garcia, Earl Spence is going to be in line to fight Manny Pacquiao next. Uh, that's what I understand, okay? I'm trying to build Earl Spence into a pay-per-view star. And if Mikey beat Earl Spence, then he'd be in line to fight Pacquiao if you want. But, um, but Floyd getting 4 to $10 million for this fight, made a $2 million, $2 million bonus for showing up for the press conference. You tell me who turned on that type of money for exhibition. You know what I'm saying? Nobody. You know, so he get his money. Uh, he insists that he ain't never doing MMA or nothing else. Um, he a boxer, and that's what he knows. We knew that. We knew Floyd wasn't getting to the octagon with Khabib or getting the octagon with Conor McGregor. Uh, we knew all that, man. Floyd is a real, real, uh, he got a lot of men short man complex, okay? He got to sit on top of the mountain and beat his chest and say that he the best and he did. nobody did it like him. So be it, all right? So, you know, get his money. I don't care about his exhibitions. Get every damn dollar. If you're still fighting, get every dollar while you can. If you secure for life, you know, you don't need to be out here doing this, right? But like I say, I don't count, not counting his pockets, but I'm a, I'm an advocate of getting all the money while you can. 
And um, I ain't mad at him. But, hey, it's good fellow sports TV. Appreciate everybody for checking in. I want to check out my other channel, Mercy Sports Talk, Everything Detroit. If you're interested in that type of talk, Lions, Pistons, um, the current events that's going on in Detroit and stuff of that nature. Also, you can follow me on Facebook and Twitter. Both links in the description. Um, you can add me on Twitter, DM me on Facebook and Twitter. Also, you can email me as well. Business inquiry, sponsorships, or whatever situation may be. Any issues with the channel or you know anything you you know you need to know, want to start a channel, keep me up on any of those platforms. Also, got a Facebook group as well. Check us out. Um, in addition to all of that, want to make a donation to the channel. That link's there as well too. Also, the intro instrumental link is in the description. Check him, check out the homie. He got a lot of dope beats. Um, you can use, and um, you know, pretty much that's it, man. Share the videos, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell icon button. Good for the sports TV. We gone.